quick update from Imran joining us at this point live. Uh, Imran, the situation there as of now, because this ritual earlier was to be uh, conducted at the site there. Now, owing to the sensitivity section 144 that has been imposed, it was at a mandir where this puja was thereafter shifted. Well, absolutely. We are at the mosque side now. We can show you that the green screen is where the disputed structure is, where the, where the section 144 has been imposed. The uh, heavy police bandabas is there. Even media is not allowed to go near the structure. As you can see, the, the, more, the start, moment we start moving, the cops are stopping. Anybody, uh, anybody pa passing through this area, all vehicles passing through this area, entry points are checked. They have been uh, thoroughly checked and leave left from here. This is the spot where they earlier wanted to contact, uh, conduct the uh, Tambula Prashna, but since section 144 has been imposed, they have moved away to a nearby local temple. Now, this is just one kilometer from here. If I can show you that green screen is where the district administration has uh, right now asked nobody to be trespass, allowed to be trespassed in that particular area. On August 21st, when the Masjid guys went for a renovation, the Hindu groups claim that they found elements of a Hindu temple below the, below the Masjid and the VHP uh, Sharan the regional convener was here and after which they approached the court for get a stay order in this issue. After which a stay order has been given, district administration has clamped this area with section 144. Nobody is allowed in this particular area. Uh, masjid size, however, says that it's an 800-year-old masjid. They have documents to prove that this is a masjid for almost five centuries now. And uh, they, they say that this issue has been raked up considering the elections are coming up next year in Karnataka. The Hindu side, however, says that there is a historical uh, records also they have have. They also want a ASI to conduct a survey, especially uh, you know, look at the designs of the of the of the right. uh, temple, like uh, some uh, uh, pillars which are there below the masjid, and uh, submit a proof. They also uh, conducting a puja now, which they say that established that uh, uh, Vedic uh, rituals, which say that uh, through which they have established that it's a, it's a temple there. They are now they have gone for another puja now to establish which is the deity in this particular uh, was spot was there, and they are also going to submit their findings and stuff research to the to the to the to the to the the important thing is now what the district administration do because the magistrate has the power he has to go through the records of endowments and both work and after right. which what he decides is what uh, everybody is looking up for uh, but uh, tense atmosphere in Malali in Mangaluru a police uh, bandobas is there we are in one kilometer from here VHP is doing we are still carrying on their puja all right continue to be with us uh, Imran we'll also now play out another breaking news coming in we have a first reaction from the state government on uh, the mandir issue they now say, the Home Minister of, for the state, that it's a matter of people's faith and that if they believe in something, and why should the government interfere in that? We'll first play out that reaction. the <laughs> Uh, Imran, coming back to you on that, because now we have got an official word from the state government. Doesn't seem that they will be interfering or looking at it anytime soon there. But what is being said as far as going through those documents are concerned, because it was being said that the administration is looking into uh, the authenticity of those documents to actually pinpoint exactly what it was before. Well, absolutely, it's been a more than a month. The district collector, as I said, April 21st, last month, April, its issue started, but so far the district administration hasn't taken any any decision so far. Uh, they have, uh, in, in fact, the Muslim side is saying that they're, they're delaying the entire process. They could have easily go, ascertained the documents from the endowment department and from the work board, and if there is any reference to the uh, existence of a temple uh, earlier they could have easily decided on the on the decision so far no decision has been taken and as far as the design right. of the structure the muslim side said that the masjid side is that you know th there was a syncretic architecture that time it was ne it didn't used to be like what it is right now and uh, they are open for asi to come and look go through their documents also but so far the state government like the home minister has said it's a big boost for groups like vhp and bajrangal because they said that yes. it's a matter of faith and they cannot intervene and uh, uh, 
uh, then uh, it's, a, it's a question of only of legality now and documents. We have to wait and see when the district administration or the district magistrate will take that decision. Mm -hmm. So far, contestations are happening there. So far, it has been peaceful and uh, no untoward incident has been reported. Right. Heavy police presence is there uh, and uh, the groups also have uh, peacefully been uh, uh, putting across their